thing is family welfare services definition what is the family so family refers to one or more person who are depends on one another for the emotional physical and the economical support okay introduction the ministry of health and family at the center and state plays an important role in the governmental efforts in the delivery of health and the family welfare services to people in the country okay then aims what is the aims of family welfare services first one is welfare of the each citizen saving the lives of mother and children checking the population growth okay then services rendered under the family welfare are antenatal registration immunization screening of high risk pregnancy and the follow up anemia correction intranatal care emergency obstetric services postnatal care newborn care family welfare services family planning services mtp services micro surgery or the cancer screening then the services rendered under family planning activities may be described as clinical services like maternal child health services those who have a completed their family size are motivated to the option for a terminal method of the contraception okay then those who wish to postpone the arrival of their next child are advised the spacing methods with due to emphasis on the oral pills or the coperty insertion okay then tubectomies are performed at the clinics attached to the primary health center and the district hospital then domiciliary services education and motivation of the eligible couple individually follow up of the intra uterine device and the pills is there and most operative sorry post operative follow up of the vasectomy tubectomy and the medical terminology of pregnancy cases then domiciliary care of the antenatal intranatal postnatal infant and the toddler care then referral services for those having the special problem of the post operative complication then family planning survey this will comprise the collective on of information like demographic cultural and the socio economic about the place and the people preparation of village map and household list and identification of the eligible couples then expected mothers infants and the preschool children and the collecting information about other agency engage in the delivery of the family planning services then identification of the community leaders identification of the local male and female leaders and other influential persons in the community and the mobilizing their support and participation in the program implementation is an essential factor for the success of the program educational activities nurses have to vital role to play in the term of providing the education and motivation for the popularizing small family norms they have to explain the people that population increase should not be viewed from the narrow view point of economic benefits to the family okay this should not viewed then motivational effort educational activity must be supplemented by the motivational efforts utilizing the information from the eligible couple register the eligible couples should be motivated individually and the collectively then maintaining the adequate supplies contraceptive distribution de- depots should be established in each village to ensure the continuous supply of contraceptives then organizing the special campaign okay this will include the organizing the intensive drives iud camp and the vasectomy and tubectomy camp periodically to boost the target achievement then beyond the family planning services female literacy enhancing the child survival and the development then anti poverty program and old age security
then improve the program planning delivery and the management upgrading the technical service and the follow up care then integrating the field worker into the health care system and improve the program management manpower development and the training and monitor evaluation and the research then role of the community health nurse in the family welfare first one leadership they have to play in the leadership position he will be responsible for the proper and the successful implementation of the family welfare services in the primary health care area including the information education communication activities motivation and delivery of the services and after care then he will be responsible for giving the immediate and the sustained attention to the any complication the acceptance developed due to the acceptance of the family welfare method in his area he should carefully watch the morbidity and the mortality of acceptor for the immediate action he or she will extend the motivational advice and contraceptive services temporary or otherwise it can be permanent to all eligible couples he seems in the clinics conducted by him at the primary health care and he will trained in service operation mtp and the iud he will maintain the record of training status of the primary health care staff on health and the family welfare and he will ensure the adequate supplies or the equipment drugs contraceptives and educational materials required for the services and he will organize the monthly staff meeting to review the progress made and to discuss the problem and the future plans he will development and maintain a cooperative work relationship with other agency and opinion leader in the primary health care area in order to generate and sustain the family welfare movement he will ensure the proper and up to date maintenance of the eligible couple registered through spot checking health committee ward committee modular committee chadda committee kartar singh committee and the shivastav committee 